What's up everyone, Steve again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24-7. Hope you're having a good day and hope you enjoy this video. Now, I've done this video because I've had a few questions. What is your favourite RC? And I thought, well, that's perfect. I've done these a few times. I'll do it again for uh, some of the new guys or, you know, anyone who is interested. So I get asked, what is my favourite RC of all time? Now, it's a hard question to answer. I've got so many nice RCs, you know. I love all types of RCs. Bashings, I love my X-Maxes and stuff like that. My tanks, of course. These awesome, you know, FMS jimmies. I love all that scale look. Now I'm an old school guy, I was born in 81. So I'm in my 40s now. So this here, I think, I kind of, I think this is one of my favorite RCs. Now, if you haven't seen this, I'll leave the link, go check it out in the top corner there. This is a Toyan X-Power. Now, this, was a kit. Now, I've done a whole build series and I'll leave the links as well down below and also try to remember it, put them up in the top corner for you to go check it out. But it is a kit. It is expensive and you can actually go buy it. Links are down below if you want to. But why I love it is because it's very similar to a Tamiya uh, Blazing Blazer from back in, the, uh, back in the day. And that's why I think I love it. It's got to it pay homage to that in a way. And I really, really do love this car. I think it is one of my favorite RCs. Now, it is a four-stroke nitro engine. It's got a hood and everything. If you haven't seen it, check out all. Look at that. It's got a Toyan L200. It's equipped with uh, neutral. It's got three-speed forwards. also got a, a reverse. It's got high and low, and it's also got a locking front uh, differential so you can uh, unlock it and stuff on the actual remote. And it's also got a push button start and all that kind of cool stuff done a huge video on that as well if you want to go check it out it's got alloy wheels and everything just looks awesome check out this so wow uh, so what we're looking at here like i said l200 that's a two-cylinder four-stroke nitro engine there's your steering server up the front now here's all the cool gadgetry and gizmo that makes this awesome so this is your filler up where you pour the nitro fuel in there. It's got a breather hose. There's your fuel inlet. Single carburetor, which is good with this new, uh, all these carts. No more dual carb, it's only single, makes it much easier. Really nice setup here where it uh, goes into the gearbox. So there's your all metal casing gearbox, all aluminium and uh, CNC machine gears in there. You have your high, low, you have your forward and reverse and underneath here, I've made it two servos, so one for throttle and one small one here for brake. And underneath here, just here, is your servo to lock the front end rear differential. So as you can see, it's an awesome, awesome car. That's why it's one of my favorites. So I should run it more on the channel. I've just been doing other things, but it's really nice quality. It's all aluminium pretty much. There's the only plastic you see will probably be the casings on the servos themselves. And uh, yeah, that's about it. But I think, yeah, I could, I could say this is probably my favourite RC. And I want to ask you guys, what is your favourite RC? I think, uh, to me, it doesn't matter about performance or anything like that. Sometimes it's just what kind of gets you going. And these kind of things remind me of when I was a kid. Same as this guy here. So here is the USA 1, Kyosha USA 1. And I couldn't afford this when I was young. But this is the updated uh, brushes version. I did have the... Uh, Savage as well, and that was one of my favorite. That was the uh, Nitro. I actually traded it for this guy here. So as you can see, beautiful car. And all the crawlers and all that kind of stuff here, yeah, I do love that. So I've got three X-Maxes, so obviously. I've got, uh, got a kind of a sick passion for those, but they uh, they just work. But yeah, what, what, what is your favorite RC, guys? And if you want to see more of this car on the channel, let me know. I was, I was actually wanting to put and I guess that's a good segue for this. This isn't starting, so I'm just trying to figure out why. Just uh, speaking to Toyan now about it. But uh, yeah, there's actually, I saw a link ages ago saying they're going to get different motor mounts to easily adapt different motors to chuck in here. So the, uh, I don't know, the rotary, but you got the uh, V8 as well. But we'll see how we go. And that's another one, the rotary. I'm waiting on a starting system for that because at the moment you can't actually start it unless you go full... Uh, caveman style hook up like a bump starter to it and all that kind of stuff but uh 
they have a stand at the moment and I'm just waiting for that to be delivered. But uh, interested to see what you think of your uh, favorite RC car and why. So cheers guys, short video, something different, but I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.